Watch Denver Fashion Week is officially underway. This season, they expanded to seven shows. They usually only do three to four. I sat down with a local vintage boutique in Rhino, the Lost Room Collective, about what it means to be part of Denver Fashion Week's Sustainable Night. I have so many people pick up this skirt. Meet the co-founders of the Lost Room Collective. Oh yes, look at that one. Isabella Conti, Emily Kaler, and Lily Walters. We want sustainable fashion to be really accessible to people, so we don't want anything to be intimidating. Their store was born from their mutual passion for all things vintage. I feel like vintage in general can be a little bit intimidating because sizes are different, styles are different, so we want to help people feel comfortable shopping sustainably. The trio gets to show off 11 of their best looks Saturday, April 9th on the runway. When you think of Denver, it's really cool to have a, a full day for sustainability. That's really huge. It's kind of an ode to what Denver is. Haley Hodap is the runway producer and director for Denver Fashion Week. We have to have some, some type of purpose and mission behind what we do. She says Sustainable Night was such a hit last season, they brought it back. I think that sustainable fashion is just a conversation for the forefront of where fashion in general is going. It's a conversation Isabella, Emily and Lily live by. I think it's really about like bringing different pieces from different eras together to create a really unique look. Um, kind of straying away from like that box of always trying to dress in like the current trends, just knowing that you can shop and style from a bunch of different pieces and bring a look together. Such a cool story. You got to check them out in Rhino. And similar to last season, each night has a theme. So earlier this week, they had the kids show with kids designers, streetwear and wardrobe. Tonight is local couture. That's at their smaller studio, Void Studios. Thursday at their bigger venue. It's international night. Saturday, like I mentioned, sustainable night where you can see the Lost Room Collective. And then Sunday is lifestyle. So all those shows are at the Forney Museum, which seats about a thousand people. So it's a much bigger venue. They do still have tickets left for tonight's show uh, about 125 bucks it's for second row but still not really a bad seat in the house especially with the smaller venue so denverfashionweek.com for your tickets for all the shows i love to see it so yeah fun. and i was i was asking mm -hmm. you are these models local yeah. and they are for the they most are. part yeah so all the local designers and you know all the local talent basically they're pulling hair and makeup and models all locally so it's really cool they get to show off all the denver talent yeah it's and yeah. the studios it's a really cool venue too. Yeah, so that's the smaller one. It's going to seat uh -huh. about 500 and then the Forney Museum seats about a thousand people. So they're like doubling their size from just wow. last season and then having the seven nights of shows. It's really cool. It's All grown right. a lot. Yeah. Wow. We'll have fun. Thank you. <laughs>